This is a, a, a tree which is going quite well. It's done quite well over the last few months. It's got a, quite a lot of new growth up here, which is great. Nice, healthy green. But one issue we're having with a lot of the trees is getting this, this growth here, which is under the graft. So um, what we'll do, we'll prune that, which is pretty straightforward. Just pull off the, the little branch there and we'll prune off this one as well. So we don't want any new growth beyond, below the graft. And you can tell, you can tell the leaf, it's new growth because below the graft, the leaves are much spikier than above the graft. So this is sort of a more, more primitive tree, which is a stronger rootstock. And so we don't want those leaves to be growing. You compare that growth there, this one here, to this one here, which is above the graft. And it's a much, much different sort of leaves. The leaves above the graft are less spiky. And um, so we'll leave that one here. That, that could be a new, a new growth coming out, a new branch, which is really great. What are you doing here? We're getting rid of the, the growth below the graft points, the spiky leaves. Get rid of this nasty little one. from the base of the tree. That's fine. This one's okay too. Mm. Okay, let's have a look at this last one in the row. And this one is interesting because the location. Oh, yeah. Near the big eucalypts, these big, big grey gums. Yeah. People think we need a lot of the space to plant tree. In fact, is this tree is sitting in between two massive size of the eucalypt. Yeah. Look yeah. at that. It's really, really big, and that one too. It was interesting to see how it goes. Is it under the shade of a big trees? Not very often though, not much. But seems like doing okay at this stage. Yeah, so here we've got another tree, which is really going really nicely. Got a lot of new growth there. It's new growth off a few branches here and there so it's it's extremely healthy looking plant but again it's got those little little below graft growths as well so we want to we want to take them off just pop them off like that i'm wearing my gloves now which is nice get rid of all those suckers there but a bigger problem here again is this fireweed it's a noxious weed it's a terrible plant there are talks about getting an insect in from South Africa, I think, to kill it. But I'm just going to pull that out. I'm wearing my gloves now, so it shouldn't poison me. I'll just pull this rubbish out. And get rid of this one over here. The stuff is everywhere, not just on this one, it's everywhere. And it's just poisonous to cattle. It's nasty stuff. wood chip we put down it's still here but you can see straight it's already over a few months it's starting to break down already so this is what we want we want to have something which breaks down increases organic matter that makes the, the tree a healthier healthier and happier and it does look pretty healthy and happy right now <laughs> 